Hello everyone. I'm Hao Xiangshi. I'm two students supervised by Professor Sakai from Waseda University. It is my pleasure to do our presentation about my own paper, a seven seven architecture for learning Chinese sentence similarity. As we are known, finding an excellent approach to measure the similarity between word sentence paragraph and document is very important, and it can be applied in many fields, such as information retrieval, document clustering, and machine translation. In the past, to calculate the similarity method like CFIDF were based on word level, and it is very difficult to catch global level meaning. For example, there are two sentences in Table 1. 怎么买液晶电视？怎样的液晶电视才好 ？The English corresponding translation are how to buy an LCD TV and what is a good LCD TV. From the word level, they look the same. However, the semantic information is diff is totally different. Different. Then, with the development of machine learning, using neural network to learn latent recognition of sentence level meaning is a popular method. In 2013, uh, third, uh, Google proposed a, sh a shallow structure named work to vector which can represent sentence level embedding, which, uh, where all the disadvantages is that in sentence similarity test, it is impossible to obtain the two sentence Latin representation in the same time because the traditional neural network can only have one input. And if uh, obtain Latin representation for two times, which will obtain inconsistent Latin representation because the parameter change, change times by times. Hence, the LSPM Simon's architecture was devised, devised in two 2016, which can have two inputs and can achieve the two sentence representations in the same time. And in my paper, we replied a seven seven architecture used in image processing in Chinese sentence similarity learning. The result in binary classification. Similar or not similar for Chinese sentence pairs uh, shows that CN Simmons architecture outperforms the Simmons recurrent uh, architecture. This is our model architecture. In, the archite in this architecture, there are two alike uh, convolutional structure, and the input of each convolutional structure has a correct level embedding of sentence, and the output of the each convolutional structure as a sentence level representations. Then a similarity matrix is used to compare the output of the two convolutional structure. Within each convolutional architecture, there are one fully connected layer after three re re uh, repeated convolutional layers and max pooling layers. We also uh, we have also tested the six repeated structure, but the accuracy don't shows a significant improvement. The kernel set of each convolutional layer is different. After uh, calculating the similarity, we use the mean square error as the loss function. In this way, there are two convolutional structures will share the same parameters, and then. We can learn the representations of the two sentences with the same distribution. Based on threshold of similarity, we can evaluate the accuracy after learning. Which, uh, and I will give you the experiment parameter information. We choose LC, QMC, uh, Chinese dataset, and PAWS. X English dataset, we use a constant similarity and a Manhattan similarity, and we choose an accuracy as our matrix and the three repeated convolutional layer corner size is three four five and learning rate is zero point zero 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 one and the similarity threshold is zero point five. 
and this is the format of uh, LCQMC evaluation. In the left figures, we compare the con conversion speeds and the loss of the all combination of the Simmons architecture as the true loss function. As a result, the Simmons convolutional architecture with Manhattan similarity matrix achieves the lowest loss. In the right figures, we evaluate the accuracy of all combination of the Simmons architecture and the true loss function. This is it can be said that the Simmons convolutional uh, architecture always achieves a higher accuracy. And uh, we listed uh, all the ex experimental results in Table 1, including using LCQMC dataset and PWX dataset. It can be observed that when using LCQMC dataset, both Simmons convolutional architecture with the Manhattan similarity matrix and the Cosine similarity matrix outperforms the Simmons bidirectional LSTM architecture and the Simmons LSTM architecture. Specifically, our Simmons convolutional architecture with the Manhattan similarity uh, matrix outperforms the Simmons bidirectional LSTM architecture with Manhattan similarity by 8.67 points and the Simmons LSTM architecture by 8.68 points. Convolution, we proposed a Simon CN architecture for Chinese sentence similarity and achieved better performance than recurrent Simon's architecture. And in the future, we will apply BERT and transformer to finish sentence similarity task. And thank you for your listening.